Welcome guys, welcome back. Now let us understand metaphors. Can you see this uh, baseball glove? The material, the ball. Can you see what emotional qualities it gives you? It's like a lived in material. Gets better with time. Brown color leather products, it's enduring. It's molded to the body so that it feels so strong to catch a very fast moving ball, see? And same attributes, actually can you relate it with the chair guys? Catching people like a ball. <laughs> imagine that. Can you, can you imagine catching people like a ball? I mean, of course, in the name of metaphor, you should not design like this. This is too obvious. If you make something like this, people will laugh. <laughs> of course, you can make a funny design. That's okay. But this is not a precise metaphor, guys. This is a pre pre precise metaphor. Are you seeing it? Are you feeling it? And this is also metaphor, guys. Can you see? This is a banana juice packer okay there is a small tetra pack for banana juice and there is a banana how do you communicate this as a banana juice can you use a metaphorical principles can you take emotional quality same like we took for the chair design of this is done by charles and ames guys very very famous chair design and this is inspired largely from this what do you call this baseball class see wonderful right it catches the people like a ball safety uh, gets better with emotion with over time it molds to the body enduring lived for years right can you can you relate to this it's very natural fresh total character of a banana it's actually showcasing the banana yellow color skin peel the form everything so can we understand emotional qualities of this package it's natural it's fresh it's total character of banana why because it is showing the color of yellow it is making the creases and folds like the banana it is showcasing exactly the overall form of it is not exactly banana guys of course that's too obvious we can't do that this is reflecting the characters can you see it's not the same form as banana but you can see the crease guys you can see the juice container how it's converted to banana juice container see the color the form the texture even the texture is having that crease with a little brown color so that it makes a pure banana see even the subtle bruising you can see guys the subtle bruising what they've created it shows a feel of banana see can you see that bruising in the banana somewhere wonderful right this is called metaphorical design guys see the nodal colors this is inappropriate guys nobody will eat a banana like this of course so this was a very good example given by design plus mona youtuber so she also talks largely about design and uh, emotional design factors this is one of the inappropriate uh, metaphor guys so there is something called colors associated to it it's not about product forms it's not about product characteristics. There are some colors which signify a meaning. Now, let us go and understand emotional colors in the coming video, guys.